Hey Simleys, it's Delicacy here with Let's Play The Sims 4 Bobby Season 2 episode... Uh, what episode is this? I don't even know. Let me just check because I don't want to get this wrong. Episode 12, I was right. That's what I was thinking. But anyways, Bobby is going for a bit of a jog because we have a big day today. We're actually going to be moving house. And the reason why I have posted this instead of the Twins LP, which is usually kind of on a Thursday quite often, uh, is because we have built the brand new Barbie dream house. I'm super excited about it. So I just really felt like play playing some Barbie today. And uh, I did also want to, I guess, um, I've got to move some of the things into their inventory. But especially Margie's grave over here. Uh, but one thing I did want to address was in the last issue, we had Amethyst flirt with um, a girl and uh, a lot of you guys kind of took it the wrong way and you're like, why does every character in Delicacy's LP have to like become gay or bi if they've got any like alternative personality and it's like such a stereotype. I of course did not mean that and for that reason I've decided to just be like well Amethyst was just experimenting but Amethyst is going to be straight in this LP. Uh, I just really don't want anyone to ever think um, that I believe in sexual stereotypes. I really don't. And uh, I've got friends who are gay, who are very obviously gay. And I have friends who you wouldn't even tell the difference. And I don't even care. Like, I don't even think it's an issue. Like, be who you want to be. So uh, with that all done and well and made very clear, I do apologize if I offended anyone or worried anyone. Uh, but let's move house. Let's enough of the serious business. I can't wait to move. Let's just see. I think we had a painting in here. A couple of paintings that we're going to have to put in there. Grab this one, grab that one, grab that one. I know the family's a little bit tired, but you know what? Moving is tiresome. Uh, what else do we want? What else do we want? I think it's looking pretty good. Mm. Ooh, stress teacher, do the reading. I didn't read that, but Topaz has gained a small amount of skill, which is always a good thing. Yeah, I think we've got pretty much everything I wanted to take for now. As long as we have Margie, I think that's definitely the most important thing, so. Oh, and we want our little space dude. Um, let's get this one. And I don't know about the rocket ship, if we should put that in our inventory, because it's already built. Perhaps uh, place an in inventory. Uh oh, this is going to be a lot of stuff in here. We've got some pictures of Margie. Where's that rocket ship gone? Well, it's somewhere in there. And did we have a few photos to take too? And then I think we're done. Uh, we can put those in Barbie's inventory. It's just easier to scroll through that way. So let's. This one in, this one in, this one in. What's that? Oh, that's the landscape painting. A few of the kids' paintings as well. Now we can move. Excellent, excellente. Cool, loving it. Alrighty, let's move. Where is Barbie? I feel like because she's the lady of the house eating a sandwich out of a gnome. Interesting. Uh, plate you have there, Barbie. Let's move. Okay, get in the car. Move household. Let's go. And you're stinking a little bit, but you can use the brand new shower if you like. And if you guys haven't seen the latest Barbie house speed build, it is on my channel. Uh, I just said it was posted uh, yesterday. And um, if I remember, I'll try and link it in the description down below. But we will be moving our family to to Windenburg, which is very exciting. And this is it. Uh, it's saying we can't afford it. Okay, so I fixed that up. So therefore, um, the, the Barbie or the Roberts clan have just inherited basically Barbie's full inheritance from her deceased parents, Margie, uh, because basically they were diamond agents. They had a lot of money and that 
has finally gone through the legal system and been given back to Barbie and Ken or passed on to Barbie and Ken. They've fully inherited the full amount, so they are now able to move into their brand new house. Okay, I might have done a little bit of a cheaty wheat there, but I'm pretty sure that's okay for the sake of this Barbie LP because let's be honest, when are we ever going to have 600,000 simoleons? <laughs> So anyways, I can't wait to move into the new house and put some photos up everywhere and get everyone to claim their beds. So exciting. Oh my gosh. What? Wow. Look at Barbie's breasts in that dress. So this is the new home. It's based on um, one of the houses of one of my favorite shows, Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. Um, so this is basically it. It's another symmetrical home. I'm just going to pause it for a second to give you guys the tour. Basically, it's got this romantic uh, pool area at the front. If we go over the house, we have a fountain, a rocket ship area, playgrounds. And at the very back, uh, you can see there's a nice big pool and uh, some awesome balconies. And Diamond does have the best room out of all the kids. <laughs> she somehow weaseled her way through that. So... Uh, we basically have the entrance room that has these big, gorgeous mirrors. There's a lot of mirrors in this. It's very Hollywood glam. Uh, we've got a lounge area here that is a double story um, that then leads up to this balcony up here, which is pretty cool, uh, through this staircase right here. Barbie and Ken's master suite is over here. So they have their lounge area, their bedroom and balcony, private balcony, bathrooms with, get this, ombre mirrors. How cool is that? I was so excited. It's not custom content. It's just by layering the backlit um, mirrors in different colors, you can achieve that. We have a nursery for hopefully the twins, if the twins arrive as twins. Amethyst room. Uh, guest room in case Diamond or Gem want to stay. And then this is little Diamond's very spoilt room. And yes, it's all pink just because we didn't have any nice beds that went with the red color scheme. And so I figured she can have all pink and she's got this balcony that uh, she basically said, I want the best room so that I can have my all my toys on the balcony. And she's a little bit of a brat. So um, she got what she wanted. <laughs> Because Barbie and Ken are so nice. This is Barbie's new and improved purple office right here. Very glam indeed. We have um, a second entertainment room with a bar and everything. We've got a movie area. We might actually use the movie screen from the movie Hangout Stuff Pack. The kitchen area and dining. Lots of pink in there. Very Barbie style. And then last of all over here is... Topaz's room, which is quite indie. Uh, he does want to be a comedian when he grows up, so he's got a lot of like funny, potentially comic film posters. Uh, he loves his anime characters, and um, he's got his mic set up here. So I'm really interested to further develop the character of Topaz. And yeah, so first of all, we're going to have to um, make a few changes to this house uh, just because they're now moved in. I think what we need to do is actually put in the current built rocket ship if we can find that I'm so sorry I have the sniffles I ate some M&Ms and I I know it sounds very odd but I swear it kind of clogs me up when I eat dairy because I am lactose intolerant and for those of you thinking well why did you eat dairy then that's stupid I know I know I don't need to be told ew trash fruit we have 10 of those are you kidding me wow Okay, there's Ken's ready built rocket ship. How fab. Now we're gonna get rid of that one. And it is lagging a little bit because we are in buy mode. Uh, so I'm gonna swap out of that, go back to the inventories. And quite cute. And then actually Diamond's actual canvas canvas. Maybe go there because that's quite nice. And We'll pop another one, maybe in Barbie and Ken's room. Because they would probably like a piece by their daughter in their bedroom. Yeah, we can pop that one there. Oh, I don't like that one. So let's put that one back. Excellent. Uh, one other thing we don't have anything of right here is gym equipment. I completely forgot. I don't know how, but I did. So let's put in a movie screen and some gym equipment. And then I feel like we'll have everything we need. Let's get rid of those. Um, okay. Get 
to go to electronics. TV screen, movie screen, there we go. I think we should get it in white. Hmm, it's going to have to sit a little bit down, but that's okay. No one will ever know. Well, you guys will know, but that's okay. So we've got our movie screen there and some gym equipment is probably necessary. So let's go to activities and skills. Gym stuff, we'll just get uh, the usual, the usual things we like to have. Treadmill out here. Mm, do we want a boxing bag? I think we want some of these. I know Barbie would probably have one up here on her deck for her to do that stuff on. And maybe we'll put one nice spot in the garden, maybe. Oh no, how about we get that uh, little stool thing, this one. Is there a pink version? Yes. There we go. That's all very relaxing. <laughs> and maybe get a nice bright colored one of these. Oh. I kind of like that because it's so ridiculously snazzy looking. It looks like an insect almost. But it's kind of ugly. So <laughs> we might put that against the wall over here. Hide it a little bit. Put the treadmill. I probably should move these across like that. I've got the move objects on cheat, by the way. So if you're wondering, how is she doing that? Uh, that is that is a cheat. Just slightly closer to the wall, just like that. Awesome. All right. Now I feel like this is more completed. And uh, where's Barbie? Here she is. All right, ladies. Welcome to the new house. How exciting. I love how Diamond's just so sassy. She's like, this is my new house and I'm gonna strut in automatic doors. They open for her. And Barbie's still like, what's going on? All right, she needs to definitely have a shower. I think she's exhausted from the move. So let's get her to start using her boudoir. Definitely make her claim that bird. Claim that and then you can use your bathroom. Oh, so excited. Um, take a bubble bath, perhaps, and then she can probably have a little bit of nap time. Diamond, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, she goes straight for the wardrobe. She's like, oh, look at mom's new wardrobe. Oh, I love that. <laughs> oh my God, Ruby, you are too funny. Did I just call her Diamond? I'm not really sure. Okay, Diamond, that's not your bedroom. You should play in your new bedroom. Let's claim that. And uh, let's get you to... Ooh, name the dolls. Name the doll family the... The Rose family. Here we go, Rose. Play with Rose's house. Oh, cute. So she can play up there. Amethyst is home. She's looking pretty tired. Um, girl, this is your bed over here, so you can claim that. Yeah, she needs a bit of a snoozle. Topaz, probably the same. Oh my gosh, he's even in worse shape. So I wanted him to practice, um, but that's okay. Ooh, Sophia. Where's Sophia? Oh, she's cute. Oh my gosh, she's from the Paragons. Oh, look at him just relaxing. Come on, Topaz, let's have a sleep. And if they can all have a little bit of a snooze before dinner, they can have a family dinner in the new house, which will be quite nice. So let's get him to, whoops, we'll claim that bed first and then sleep in it. My gosh, Diamond, I mean, Ruby, are you loving your new balcony? It's just so spoiled. She has not one, but two doll houses. I mean, come on. You're cutting me. Oh, Barbie's feeling very playful. Now it's time for a little bit of bed. And Ken's at work. Let's work hard. Work a little bit harder. And that sounds good. So everyone's pretty much snoozling or trying to get to their bedroom. I love Topaz's room, by the way. I think this is just his style. He's a bit indie. He's funny. I just think he's cute as well. So he's going to have a little snoozle, mix snooze, snooze there. I just love this room. I think it's so him. 
Okay, so while they're sleeping, let's get Diamond to have a great old time. She does need to use a toilet. Is she going to use her special toilet is the question? Let's see. Oh, there we go. I love hearing the tinkle time. No, I don't. That's weird. I know I love the tinkle time. Oh my God. I was like, why is there a spaceship inside their house? Just in case they want to blast off. Washing her hands. Nice one, girl. Nice one. Okay. Uh, so she's hungry. Just going to eat cereal. I reckon you should just have... A little play in the fountain whilst baby, um, whilst Barbie. Ooh, sent the color and intensity. Hmm, don't know if that did much. Uh, whilst Barbie makes some food. So let's just play in. How's Barbie going? She's not in the greatest mood. Amethyst and Topaz definitely are not up to cooking a meal. Oh, we'll just get Barbie up for now. She can go back to sleep afterwards. Get her to use the toilet and then use the brand new kitchen. I know, I know. We'll get you to go to the toilet. Oh, we have friends at our front door. Oh, don't worry, you guys. Diamond is on it. She's like, oh, hello. Hi, welcome to my house. <laughs> Take the fruit cake. Hi, this is my mansion. You can come inside if you want to. Welcome wagon. Love it. They probably need an intercom in this house. Okay, Barbie, you might actually need to come down to entertain your guests. Invite neighbors in. If there's one thing Barbie's good at, it's entertaining. She knows how to entertain, especially the ladies. Wow, renegades. You gotta love tattoos, girl. He's from the avant-garde. He does look very avant-garde to me. He looks like he could be a really good friend of Barbie's. Gunther. Oh my gosh, Barbie, put some clothes on, woman. Oh my gosh. Oh, she's feeling a little bit sickly, but that's okay. Okay, can we get the fruitcake and eat it? Invite neighbors in. She's like, I am so sorry, I'm in my nightgown. We've just moved, but you're welcome to come in and I'm happy to take that fruitcake off you. Oh, did you, are you gonna, okay, no worries. All right, well, maybe we should go into the kitchen and just make dinner for everyone because we have a lot of people here. So let's serve dinner. Uh, let's do something that will impress everyone. Let's make some chili. And uh, she'll probably wake up the rest of the kids and tell them, you know, come on, guys. We've got some friends uh, to entertain. Or at least little Ruby can entertain them for now. Talk about school. I love this guy. She's like, how big is your house? Is it as big as mine? <laughs> She's so funny. Glad we got a chance to chat. I'm glad you guys got to, got to chat as well. How's Barbie going over here in the kitchen? She's halfway done. Barbie, I really think you should change into something a little bit more appropriate. Making that chili. Oh, oh, okay. Okay then. Oh good. Uh, so we have Ruby up to social level five. Good to see. Good to see. Let's get toe pads in the shower just before dinner. Oh wow. Okay and we cannot reach that plate. So <laughs> food for us. How nice. Uh, yeah. Why don't you just help yourself? <laughs> I really dislike it how they put food behind things. There we go. Like they don't realize the object's there. Call to meal. Everyone have some. Food for one, one for all. Food for all, for all for one. Okay, 
It's just cold. Everyone's a meal. Come on, Ruby. Oh, I love how Amethyst is just in her little pyjama shorts. Amethyst would potentially wear some of the new clothes as well. Oh, look at that. Barbie's got a bump. Yay. Woo. Okay, everyone come sit down. Come enjoy some dinner. Come enjoy some tucker. Topaz is tense from, oh, he's so desperate for fun. Yeah, and he likes a lot of humor too. So maybe he'll have a bit of fun telling some jokes at the table. <gasps> is there enough for you? Oh my gosh, there's not enough for little Ruby. That's right, girl. You can just take one of these. Eat that. Barbie's eating too. Okay, so everyone in our family is happy. That's good. How about we talk to Gunther? Cause, oh no, don't flirt with him. Oh my gosh, Barbie, do not do that. Funny introduction. I oh know we only need one. And uh, it was a little bit awkward for Topaz and Amethyst in the last part. And Topaz does not look happy about that, but let's just maybe express admiration. What What is he doing? No, I don't mean for you to get up. You can still eat the chili. You need to eat. Oh, Amethyst just had to, had to have a quick uh, selfie moment. There we go. Isn't that nice? Having dinner with the neighbors, even though they're all in their pajamas. Barbie's like, I want you to be my new best friends. Oh, she's got a bit of back pain there. Thanks for coming and maybe share the big news. Damn, that chili looks good. I want it. I want it real bad. <laughs> dag, dag. Well, I think it's time to go. Uh, see you around. Thanks for hosting. No walkers. Thanks for coming around, miss. And, uh, oh, I thought you were going to be our new best friends. Okay, whatever. Okay, she's going to sleep. She don't care. And little diamond, um, little ruby. <laughs> she's like a little diamond time for you and I reckon Topaz and Amethyst like I know they're a bit sleepy and smelly and whatnot but I reckon they should watch a movie together I mean why not why not watch a movie uh diamonds are for sims well that's appropriate isn't it let's watch that with Amethyst Have a little bit of a movie night because Barbie definitely needs to go to bed and oh she's washing her hands did she just pee in the bush Okay, then, girl. I mean, whatever. If nature calls, then maybe you should pee in nature. I get it. I get it. Okay, I wonder where they'll sit. Oh, my gosh, Topaz. Oh, I just want you guys to get some fun up. Yay! We should have made some popcorn. Ooh, it looks like crime. Okay, Topaz is just like... I, he's had enough, you guys. He just wants his shower. I gotcha. He's really uncomfortable. Well, there's plenty of bathrooms in the house. Oh, she's like, oh, I wanted to hang out with Topaz. Oh, well. Amethyst is nice, isn't she? She's so pretty. With her purple hair. All right, girl. At least that's getting her fun up a little bit. And hopefully the next part they'll be in far better moods. Yeah, yeah, I know. She's asleep, she's asleep. He is feeling playful in the hot tub. That's all right, let's just speed this up a little bit so we can get that uh, hygiene up. Awesome. <laughs> I love how close she's standing to that film. That's how engrossed she is in it. <laughs> funny, funny, funny. All right, we might get her to use the toilet, get some hygiene up, and that sounds good. Anyway, guys, I'm just going to leave this part right here. I hope you are having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I'll speak to you soon.